Hey guys, guess who's back? Good old Tennessee Jim. Yeah, I'm I'm doing another video. I'm doing a video of several different things. One, I'm back to my nickels. We're gonna search this circulated box of nickels. And I've got a little bit of a mail call and some gifts that were given to me and some things that I've found. So stay tuned. Because Tennessee Jim is coming up next. Hey guys, this is uh, something I got from, um, <coughs> excuse me, it's uh, Off the Grid Power. Uh, first of all, he, he gave me a couple of his stickers, which is great. <coughs> his note, so Tennessee Jim, here are uh, my stickers, enjoy. Also, a little something extra, stay strong. And gave me a couple of his stickers, which I, I've already got a sticker of his on my board. And then he gave me this. I don't know if you can see this or not, but it's uh, one Utah gold back. This is so neat. This is a, uh, it's one twentieth of a troy ounce of gold in this that is so so neat and and in Utah, I think if we can see it on here. It said um, I can't read it. Anyway, like you can use this in trade in Utah. It's a Utah gold back, and that is just so cool. So if I go to Utah, I can spend this. I'll never spend this. This thing is so cool. It is really, really neat. How it's how it's made and and uh, it's beautiful. Thanks. I really appreciate that, guys. That uh, those stickers will will come in handy, and uh, that gold buck. I'll probably put it in my uh, my uh, currency book. And speaking of currency, here's a couple of uh, 20s that I found lately in in, uh, in my currency. I want you to look at these numbers. 6664440. Six, 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 four, 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 zero. That wow, that's too cool. And here's one it's 6667555. Six, 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 five, five, five. I can't remember what those are called. Um but uh because uh, I'm I'm just getting into this, so it's uh, binary, trinary, not not trinary. It's a binary note, I think. Anyway, there it's kind of rare, so I've put that into my currency book, collecting those. Now, here's something else that I got from my um, my daughter and son-in-law. Uh, they went to a place and picked up a couple of things. And uh, this is just too cool. Just too cool. Let me get these two coins out. This one is, it's a buffalo nickel. 24 gold, 24 karat gold clad buffalo nickel. Now they paid my bucks for me. Uh, I don't know if you can catch it or not, but that thing's gold. It's got 20, it's 24 carat gold I guess plated over it but it, it too flipping cool that is a super nice buffalo nickel uh, speaking of buffalo nickels uh, I know I showed this to you before but um, uh, Willis had sent me it's uh, graded a uh, MS65 it's a 1913 first year issue top one buffalo nickel and that i'm telling you guys that thing is just beautiful just beautiful that's incredible but uh okay also what my uh daughter and son-in-law got me was this it's a roman coin second 
to 5th century. Okay? It is a Roman coin. And, uh, incredible. I would never find anything like that here. And I'll doubt that I'll ever get over to uh, to England. But that is just beautiful. I guess it's bronze. Uh, certainly looks like it. But that is a beautiful coin. And, and later on, I don't know if it'll be on this one or not, but I'll put it under my microscope and let you see it even better because I haven't even seen it that way. All right, then, then they got me something else. Um, you know, I, I collect money from, of course, from here, but also collect money from other countries also. And here they sent, this is from Malaya. Ten cents, this was back in World War II, it was used back then. This is um, 1st July of 1941. And uh, you really can't see nothing on the back on it. It's just been, I don't know what happened to the back. But uh, that is too cool. And then the other one is German. It's from Germany. And um, I, I don't know what... Um, well, two, two, uh, I have no idea, R written mark something, it, it's too cool, but it's a, uh, it's really cool, I don't, I've got some foreign money too, but I've showed you that before, and then the other, the last thing is this two dollar bill, now it has been written on, and it does have some creases in it. But um, it's a kind of a low mint mark. Mint mark. Low serial number. And if you notice, it's got the red ink, the red seal, and the red serial numbers. And it says, uh, United States Note. Now, if you look on your currency nowadays, it says uh, Federal Reserve Note. So that's... That's old. That's from 1953. And uh, that is something really cool. That'll put get into my collection also. But I uh, just wanted to show you that. Those are the things that I've got either through through the mail or from my uh, daughter and, and son-in-law. Next, we're going to do some nickels. So, stand by and watch. Who knows? We might learn something today. All right. Hang on. As you can see, I've got two inhalers here. Let me, let me tell you something about cost on stuff. This inhaler cost about $55. This inhaler cost $380. I've already been through one of those. I've already been through a couple of these. I'm telling you, the cost, the medical cost, on you know, things are crazy. This, you know, right now, my last I heard, my medical, my bills at the hospital and doctor's offices and things is a little over 10000 Now, I've paid, I've paid some of that with the, uh, the uh, contributions that were made and given to me on my PayPal, I've got it down to ten thousand. It was, it was probably something around fifteen thousand. So I've got it down. But the thing about it is, that's before I've even started my chemo and radiation treatment. God knows how much that's going to cost. So again, here I go asking if you have anything that you can send and help me out, because I have no insurance. If you can help me out in any way financially, and just, you know, give a dollar or two here, whatever you can, my PayPal, I will put, uh, I'll try to put it here, but if it's not there, it is in my About 
section. It will also be in my description down below. So, but if you can put in, you know, send anything to me, I would most likely appreciate it. Not most likely, but I would certainly appreciate it. Every penny that, that y'all send is going to go towards that. So, I thank you in advance. And I'm not going to say anything else. Anyway, we're going to get to the Nichols hose. Hang on a minute. Stand by. All right, on these first 10 rows, I got a, a 1946. Uh, wait a minute. Yeah, 46. And a 49. Both of those are Philly. I got a 54 Philly. 56 Philly. 257 Denver. And a 58 Denver. And I got from our friends up north. I got a Canadian nickel. It's a 9. 1986 that will go into my collection of um, Canadian coins that I have so but anyway not too bad on the first 10 rolls I'm kind of tickled all right let's go to the next 10 yeah I've all right I've got the one. next 10 is a 1941 yeah. Denver two okay. 1946 and one 1957 and one from our <laughs> northern uh, friends, another Canadian, and it's yeah, you can. The, the dates on it is 1967 to 1997, I think. Anyway, this is a I can't remember what they call it now. Anyway, it's a special edition coin or something. But anyway, there's that 10. On to the next. All right, the next 10 rows. I got two 1940s. These, <laughs> 1941, 1946, and 1951. All those are fillies. But my best one was this. Got me a Buffalo Nickel, 1936. And it's got a mint mark on it. FD for Denver. Nice looking coin. All right, going to the next 10. Okay, on these 10 rows, I got a 40 Denver, a uh, 40, uh, I think it's 47, let me make sure, yeah, it's a 47 Philly, 54 Philly, 57 Philly, 57 Denver, and a 59 Philly, that's what I got on those 10 rows, alright, on to the next, last 10 rows didn't put out much as a matter of fact the last roll is what I got these from these two 1958 and one 1959 okay. now to put everything out this is what I got two for two 1940s three 41s one two four 46s a 47 a 49 a 51 Two fifty fours, fifty six, and five fifty sevens, two fifty eights, and three fifty nines, and two Canadian uh, nickels, and one Buffalo nickel, nineteen thirty six D. All right, children, <laughs> that's it for the night. That's what I got. We all. Um, like what you see, uh, subscribe and smash that like button and tell others about it. Uh, I'm going to put my PayPal up there. I talked to y'all about that before. And uh, y'all have a great day. Talk to you later.